Hi team, bit of bonus content here. This video I've added in just to show you how we can create nice looking APIs by changing the icons and also banners of a class. I'll also have to show you how we can uh, change the wire style as well. So to do that, we need to right click on our class, in this case camera or LV class, go to properties, and this is going to bring up the class properties window. We go over to the VI icon template here and click edit icon. We can add in some text to this banner. Now this banner is actually going to propagate its way through to all of the VIs um, in the class. Next, let's have a look at the wire appearance. So this is where you can select a custom wire appearance. After all, a class is a custom data type, so let's have a custom wire. Let's click OK. Now if you click OK and this message appears, it's just asking, hey, do you want to apply it to everything in your class? And yes, we do. So let's have a look at one of the methods. If we open up a capture image, we can see that our camera banner has just been propagated to those methods. So the icon overlay has been applied, but we still need a meaningful icon. So we can go back into the icon editor and uh, customize our icon. The controls and indicators of the class should also be changed. So let's open up the control file, double click on the icon, and we can change the icon the same way as any other uh, VI. So there we go, we've created a nice looking API here by customizing uh, the banner, the VI icons, and also the control icon. So I'm going to do a cheeky shortcut here of control space, control shift W to auto wire and clean up. And I'll create a, a camera constant here. So you can see here we have the control file with the custom icon too.